President Buhari has signed the 2021 Electoral Act Amendment Bill into law. The signing ceremony took place at the council chambers of the presidential villa Abuja earlier today. Presidents of the signing included the chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Mahmoud Yakubu, the Senate President, Hamed Lawan, among others. The ascent has come in a few days after a coalition of civil society organizations staged a protest to compel the president to assent to the amended document. Gratifying to note that the current bill comes with a great deal of improvement from the previous electoral bill 2021. There are salient and phraseworthy provisions that could positively revolutionize elections in Nigeria through the introduction of new technological innovations. These innovations would guarantee the constitutional rights of citizens to vote and to do so effectively. The bill will also improve and engender clarity, effectiveness, transparency of the election processes, as well as reduce the barriers to the barest minimum incidence of acrimony arising from dissatisfied candidates and political parties. Section 84, subsection 12, constitutes a disenfranchisement of serving political office holders from voting or being voted for at conventions or congresses of any political party for the purpose of the nomination of candidates for any election in cases where it holds earlier than 30 days to the national election. The section provides as follows. No political appointee at any level shall be voting delegate or be voted for at the convention or Congress of any political party for the purpose of the nomination of candidates for any election. This provision has introduced qualification and disqualification criteria that ultra virus the Constitution by way of importing blanket restriction and disqualification to serving political office holders of which they are constitutionally accorded protection. Arising from the foregoing, with particular regards to the benefits of the bill, industry, time, resources, and energy committed in its passage, I hereby assent to the bill and request the National Assembly to consider immediate amendments that will bring the bill in tune with constitutionality by way of deleting section 84, subsection 12, accordingly. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.